Hello boys and girls and welcome back to another video on Hatters TV. Now today it is Luton Town versus Wickham Wanderers. Now we are away today. We have sold out our allocation. There's apparently 1,800 Luton fans going today. It's the first time this year we've actually sold out a game away from home. So that's pretty decent. But hopefully the atmosphere and hopefully we can get the three points today. We don't have Sheehan today, which is disappointing due to his idiotics uh, display last week when he got sent off. But Jack Senior hopefully will come in and do the good job. When he came on last week, he did really good. So hopefully he he can continue that. Uh, Luke Gabbard obviously signed this week. So maybe he will start today. I think he will start, to be honest, because I don't think Cook performed that well last week again so I do think Luke Gabby will be starting this week. Obviously guys if we do want the playoffs we need to continue winning games. Obviously if we look at Wickham for example they've like literally gone on a run and they've been winning games left right and centre and they've got a striker there who got I believe who got released from Leighton Orient I don't know how you pronounce his name but anyway he's been scoring a load of goals recently so hopefully Cuthbert can have him in his back pocket I do reckon we will win 2-0 today. I do reckon we will win 2-0. Obviously, Wickham. I've been to Wickham twice now. Um, my first time, we drawed 1-0 out on Boxing Day. And then my second time, we won 1-0. And Karen McGeehan scored an absolute beautiful goal. So, hopefully, today, we can win 2-0. And yeah, and hopefully, the atmosphere is pretty good today. Because I really want the atmosphere to be really good. Because, obviously, when atmosphere is good, normally, we win games. So, yeah. Hopefully the atmosphere is good, and hopefully, Luton, we can get the three points. Decent ball, decent ball. No, get in the box! Box, yes! Go! Ever shot, Billy. Billy, you should have shot! There's a run! There's a run! There's a run!
So guys, I'm now back home from the Wickham game. I think we played well. Like, I think we did all right. Um, Mullins disappointing. Like really experienced centre half. You know you can't be going into challenges like that, and you end up getting sent off. That cost us the game, to be honest. Because I did think we were going to get the three points. I actually did think we were going to nick it at the end as well and get another one. But Mullins let the team down. So. And that's happened two weeks now, two games in a row now. Sheehan last week, very experienced defender, getting sent off. This week, Mullins again. I think Mullins is out for three games now because the, it was violent conduct or something stupid like that. So, yeah, no Mullins. But we do have a game on Tuesday, which is against Yeovil. I think it's the semi-finals. I think they call it. I don't know. I don't get the competition whatsoever. But I don't know if I'm going to be going to the game. Uh, it depends if my dad can get off work early. If he can, I'll be going. If not, I won't be going. But don't worry. I will be going to the Cambridge game next Saturday as well. So, anyway, if I don't go to Yeovil, I'll 100% be going to Cambridge. So, anyway. Um, apart from that. I'm glad to see Scott Cuthbert score his first goal. I think it's the first time we scored a corner this season as well. So I'm glad that Cuthbert got the goal. And yeah, I thought we played all right. Obviously, disappointed that Danny Hilton got another yellow. So he misses two games. So he misses the Cambridge and he misses the Cheltenham game as well. So it's looking all right going forward. But we need to push on. These next two home games are really are important. So... We need to win these next two home games. And so, yeah. If you did enjoy this vlog, guys, don't forget to drop a like on the vlog. And comment if you are going to Yeovil or if you felt we played well today. And subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you guys in the next video.